Okay. Hi, my name is Wyatt Bauer with Birchwood Technologies. Today we're going to be walking through how to do our True Temp color change kit on our low temperature black oxide and our Oxy Prime surface conditioner. We'll start with our True Temp black oxide. This is a 50% by volume True Temp XL. We're going to take a 10 mil aliquot of this and place it into the 50 mil Erlenmeyer flask. We're then going to QS to 20 mils or add 10 mils of water to the Erlenmeyer. We're then going to take the True Temp test solution and add 10 mils of that. And now you're going to add 2 to 10 drops of your True Temp indicator. After you've added that, give it a good swirl. As you can see, this, this tank is up to its appropriate concentration. If you have a tank that's below the appropriate concentration, you'll see a color change that doesn't arise and it will just remain in about a yellowish pale color. So let's move on to the OxyPrime. Again, take a 50 mil Erlenmeyer, take your OxyPrime XPL. Today we're using a 10% concentration bath. We're going to take 10 mils of that. Again, you're going to QS to 20 mils and add 10 mils of water. You're then going to add your OxyPrime indicator, usually about two to five drops. You'll see a nice amber colored orange arise from this color once you've swirled it. And as the instructions indicate, you generally want to add four and a half mils of OxyPrime test solution for this particular bass to make sure it's at the appropriate concentration. What you'll see here after I add the four and a half mils is you'll see that if it is at the appropriate concentration there will be no color change. If it does change to a greenish or brown color that indicates that your bath is below the recommended concentrations and you should make the appropriate additions. Generally you'll see this color green arise if your bath is not at the appropriate concentration. I hope this answers all your questions. If you have any further questions please contact us at virtualtechnologies.com.